Oh. Yeah, I said I was only gonna have one bite of that too. Today, we're making the world's hottest jello, and wait till you see what we're adding. Jesus. Uh, where's the egg beaters at? Yeah. You use the whisk that I gave you. No, I'm not using that. Um, our um, electric mixer, you don't use that for jello. Why? Okay guys, sometimes when you can't find your egg beaters, you gotta resort to the next best thing. Use our trusty drill. So basically for this, you can add two cups of hot water for the speedy method, and then it's two cups of cold water, right Olivia? Yep. But. No, one. One. We're not going to measure though, guys. We don't need to measure, okay? Anybody? If you don't measure that, you're going to have, you're, it's not going to set. If anybody knows our channel, we don't measure nothing around here. Okay, but I know that you don't do anything in the kitchen, so you're not going to be able to do I do lots in the kitchen, guys. Or hot water going in. You just want to add enough to That's about a cup. Till it dissolves. No, that's not. That's not what I need. You want to give it a little stir? Yes, you do. You want to mix? See, I want it to go with the drill because we got two full Robbies preloaded. One of 16 million Scoville Pure Capsaicin. And we got Hellgarden from... We, this is... Uh, the Hellhammer Tincture. Look at that guys, full Robbie. Going in. Okay, there's one. Now we're gonna add the Fiery Jacks Pure Capsaicin. 16 million. Interesting to know if it will even set with that in it. I know, I was wondering that with the alcohol. Mm -hmm. Okay. So basically, when we made the Christmas uh, bark, right, it, I found like we didn't have it spread out enough. There was pockets of high capsaicin in some and then, you know, not as bad in others. So with this, we'll be able to make sure everything gets thoroughly mixed. Okay, look out, okay. because they're not meant for drills. Do you want to lick the beater? No, and don't <laughs> let the dog eat either. All right, guys, so there's our jello. We're going to let it set. No, you got to put cold water in it. Oh, yeah. Come on, what would you do without me? <laughs> one no, cup, it's one cup, so about the same. Good, that's good. Drinking a spilt water. God damn. Now I gotta put the beater back no, in. No, you don't have to mix it, Aaron. Alright. Yeah, I guess Just the... to cool it off. Alright. Okay, this guy's never made jello. There we have our jello. And we'll test it when we. I think there's a hair in it. Probably from the drill. Okay, guys. So we'll test it out when it sets. We'll be back. A few hours later. Okay guys, there is our jello. She is set and 
It doesn't smell very hot. <laughs> okay, we got our spoon. Let's check it out. See how hot this is. Jello, mellow your jello. Instant heat. Holy. Yeah, instant heat right away. Definitely get the capsaicin burn, pure capsaicin burn. Definitely the hottest jello I've ever had. Got a good burn at the roof of the mouth, back of the mouth. Mm -hmm. I gotta say, not only was that the best jello I've ever had, or the hottest jello I've ever had, but also the best. My heat's climbing there, little guys. Wow. Yeah, definitely. Feels like it's all over the mouth. A good burn now. Like tongue, lips, roof of the mouth, sides of the tongue a bit, kind of underneath the tongue. Everything, everything's on fire. Wow. That's really good. Anyways, that's going to do it for me, guys. That was the world's hottest jello. Oh, yeah. It's burning good. We're a few minutes past from eating it. I got a strong whiskey chest on the go, guys. Nose is running a bit. Heat's probably a five. Man. Uh. A few minutes later. Oh. Yeah, I said I was only going to have one bite of that, too. 